In this video I'm going to talk about how I adapted my 700R4 transmission to work with an iron block LS engine with no expensive adapter kit. Since the bell housing of the transmission bolts right to the engine with no adapters, there's only three things to worry about. Throttle valve cable, torque converter bolt spacing, and the crankshaft length. To adapt the TV cable to work with the LS throttle body, you need to use a drive-by cable throttle body for the engine. There's a way to do it with drive-by wire, but it's too expensive and complicated when drive-by cable throttle bodies are a dime a dozen. The right way to do it is to buy the adapter kit from Bowtie Overdrives, but if you're like me and you don't have the time or money to put in a 4L80 or 4L60, you probably don't have the money to sink $250 into a kit for your outdated piece of crap transmission. I don't recommend that you do this if you add any power over stock to the truck engine and I don't take any responsibility for damage resulting from using this guide. It works for me, but that doesn't mean it'll work for everyone. First you need to get the cable geometry correct. The best way to do that is with a protractor and a ruler. Right here, I cut the cruise control nipple off of the drive-by cable throttle body. I flipped it around to where it needed to go. And next you need the mounting bracket. I'll post a drawing of this. I used the third hole back from the vertical and I bolted it straight to the fuel rail. <laughs> Torque converted bolt spacing is a bit different between the small block and the LS. LS uses metric and the small block uses uh, imperial work around this I used a die grinder to slot the holes inward about an eighth of an inch. The other major difference is the length of the crankshaft except for three years of the 6.0 from 91 to 01. You can tell these engines apart because the long crank 6.0 uses a flat flex plate while all the others use a dished flex plate. To account for this you need a crankshaft spacer to fit between the crankshaft and the torque converter snout. You can find them on eBay for 30 bucks or machine one yourself if you have a lathe in the dimensions.